Hello, my YouTube friends. Uh, today, a very exciting day because I'm going to this uh, Hong Kong audiovisual yeah. show and uh, lots of uh, name brand hi fi, earbuds, Bluetooth, everything you name it, they've got it. Uh, I'm going to take you in and we're going to show you what's going on here in Hong Kong. So, come join me. Thanks for watching, guys. Drop a like. These are headphone amplifiers and there are two. This is crazy. Uh, Foco headphones, one of the really top notch ones. And uh, this place is really awesome. And all these portable uh, players, I think they run on FLAC, uncompressed audio, and wave audio. And this is really something um, interesting. Check out this uh, headphone amplifier, just for headphones. And this is uh, another one. Which is pretty awesome and uh, you can get a package deal which is super duper expensive look at that that's a uh, expensive one o original price is 61,000 so that's probably eight grand US and now the the stacks very um, famous electrostatic uh, headphones and uh, it's on sale on the show so got to whip up some cash but the good thing here all these um, equipment here, usually they're on sale, so you can um, get a pretty good deal. Check out this uh, system, it's a tube system, uh, selling it for like a thousand dollars. And it comes with tube and little bookshelf speakers, which is uh, pretty interesting. I think, remember telling you the tubes are pretty awesome, keep you pretty warm uh, during winter time, for sure. Uh, these tube amplifiers are very special because they're made in China. Uh, prices are much more reasonable, but uh, I haven't seen much mainland Chinese uh, tube amplifiers. So here are the mainland style or mainland manufactured and they're from Zhuhai. So it says you walk across the bridge and you, uh, you can get to Macau. So it's pretty, pretty close by. So all these tubes here, are very good. And they have a little demo. And this is all lighted up, nice and toasty. And a speaker here. So what do you think of a uh, Chinese brand uh, Hi-Fi? Check this out, Macintosh. So these are Bluetooth speaker, but it has everything in it. So you just connect your phone, Spotify, Tidal, and uh, you have it all. So this is a mono speaker. You can get two of them to make it a uh, stereo, but at the price is like uh, almost two thousand dollars US. But a good thing in Hong Kong, you don't have to pay any uh, taxes. And these are the Klipsch speakers. They said these are brand new. They don't even have a price on it. See these mini horns on them? Pretty cool. Power cables are important, and these are the IEC cables. Uh, low distortion cables uh, make a difference on your amplifier. And uh, these power supplies too. Uh, they do really make a difference. So if you have an accessory, you don't want to use the original one, you want to get one of these. So the sound, you know, you won't hear any, hear any distortion. And here's another IEC wire. And uh, prices are really extremely expensive. Very interesting store called Let's Go. And uh, they sell these uh, headphones are really nice because they're sports headphones. And uh, Shokes. And uh, you don't have to plug these in your ears, and these really sound awesome. The, the first generations don't have the uh, woofer in them, but your ears really vibrate now. Shocks, that's the brand. Check this out, these are JBL speakers, Bluetooth. If you guys want to party, this is the place to come and get your speaker. And the cool thing, I think these speakers, you can uh, sing karaoke and uh, put a mic system to it. And uh, you can have a karaoke. 
karaoke party. My Filipino friends would uh, definitely want one of these party boxes. I didn't know Fender makes uh, Bluetooth speakers. Check these uh, out. The good thing here uh, during the show, when you get speakers or anything in the show, they usually offer it at a special price, which is uh, awesome. And some uh, earbuds here you can get. And um, these wires can cost easily cost more than the earbuds. Uh, I didn't connect my microphone here, but I hope you guys can hear me properly today during this busy show. Today is the first day, so it's uh, only Friday, and they're going to end this on uh, the last day is Sunday. So uh, hopefully you can find some interesting stuff. You might want to check it out. And the prices seems to be really reasonable, guys. Really uh, classic-looking JBL speakers. Look at them. They are just—it brings you back to the oldies, olden days, right? But they still make them, which is uh, pretty awesome. You guys still remember the the mash here, the little foamy mash speaker grill? Doesn't that bring you guys a good memory? Cord equipment is pretty good too. And here's the Elec. Elec is a, I think it's a German brand speaker. It's a pretty high end too. JBL. And a lot of Hong Kongers love tubes, you know, tube amplifiers. And, uh, which is pretty expensive. I think the most, uh, here's a JBL. The most popular speakers in Hong Kong, I think, are the bookshelf speakers. Because everybody lives in a really, really small apartment. And there's no way you can uh, fit big speakers at home. Check out the cab speakers. These are really nice pieces. Even though if they don't sound good, you really look nice in your living room. And uh, they're famous for their single driver. And, uh, and some of them have the woofers on the side. Dual woofers. So it should sound really good. lineup which is uh, really awesome and every single item is on uh, sale here and uh, they sound pretty amazing I think these are uh, one of my favorite pair of speakers these speakers sound so amazing you know I thought they had a woofer but they don't so if you guys have time, you can check out this uh, this uh, woofer. No, not woofer, speaker. Pretty amazing. And uh, they are on original prices like uh, thirty one eight, almost thirty two thousand Hong Kong, but on sale for twenty five five. And these are the small speakers. Pretty awesome. Have you guys heard of uh, Marantz? So these are uh, really nice uh, amplifiers. And they have these uh, little turnstiles or turntables. You can check out what's, uh, what you can wire up in the back. Isn't that pretty cool? And, and nowadays, all of them have uh, network lines. You can uh, pick up all your uh, network audio. You don't need CDs or records anymore. These are the things of the past. This one's like 35 grand. I think it's an in integrated uh, amplifier. Check out a package deal here. You get the Maran CD player and with an integrated amplifier for uh, like 62,000 uh, Hong Kong dollars. I'm gonna check the connections uh, for the CD player here. And check out all these connections at the back. And um, they have in, digital in and out, balance outputs, pretty cool. And all these units are made in Japan. I like
like sound bars, but the Denon sound bars, I just found out they're pretty cool because you can just pair anything with them. So you can pair many different subwoofers, uh, rear speakers with them. Uh, so you can have a wide variety. So you, ju you don't have to be stuck with one set. So you can just mix and match for all the Denon speakers. And this is a small woofer here, but uh, you can pair a really big woofer uh, because it will work uh, on the same system. So these little sound bars, I, I really like. And uh, big Denon receivers here. Oh, these are pretty big guys. So Denon is a Japanese brand, and uh, I think they're, pre they're pretty good. Always been pretty good. And uh, they have package deal. Like that's almost a hundred grand. Uh, speaker and a CD player amplifier. So do you guys think that's a good deal? You are enjoying the show with me because uh, it's really fun and I really love uh, coming here. So what do you think of my new camera? This is a Sony camera, FX3. And uh, my cousin helped me get it. Uh, it's all out of stock because of the chip shortage. But uh, he helped me up get one. So, uh, you know, thank him very much for helping me out getting this camera. So tell me what do you think of the quality. Uh, I'm pretty, it's pretty uh, nice here. Check out the vinyls. This is a pretty expensive, uh, it's like a 20, 30 dollars US per disc here. And uh, I have a lot of them. And I hate to throw them away and I don't know how to sell them. Guys, maybe you can comment down below and see what, how the heck can I get rid of them or you know, transfer it to the digital format before I get rid of them. Because uh, now I live in a really, really small apartment. KEF speakers, pretty uh, popular in Hong Kong actually. These are the LSX ones with the stand and everything. Look at the sale price. Uh, but uh, it's out of my budget, I guess. Pretty expensive. But uh, the KEF is, uh, they only have uh, one driver, but everything is included inside. That's, uh, that's one of their specialties. Some more uh, big, big headphones. This brand is a uh, Hi-Fi Man. Have you heard of a uh, Hi-Fi Man before? Uh, because I haven't. Look at these uh, wooden blocks they put on your head. And an uh, interesting Sony player. Sony brand is uh, the best, isn't it? Uh, here's more headphones, the Foco. Focos are pretty popular in Hong Kong. Foco headphones, the whole set. And uh, Foco amplifiers, display media player, NAM Audio. Yeah, and NAM Audio is pretty high end, I think. And uh, check out these uh, Foco headphones. Really, really expensive. Guys, do you like uh, round things? Because uh, all these speakers are round. This is pretty cool. Check it all out. Look at this. This is a art piece, and it's made from bamboo. And you want to even check out these uh, turntables here. Look at it. I just wanted to ask these guys, you know, when you get tired at a show, can you just sit on top? Or they might freak out. So, turntables are in. You see all these records, record cleaners. So, hope my uh, subscribers didn't throw away their old turntable because it seems that everybody's going back to their, uh, going back to the turntables. And uh, I think these are pretty fancy players here.
These uh, radios are pretty interesting. It's called Geneva Time. It's kind of classic looking machines. Look at that. I really uh, think they're interesting. You guys wanna, might want to check it out on the internet. They look classic, but I bet they sound awesome. <laughs> well, this is the Duntech Princess. It's a uh, top of line speakers. Aren't they awesome? And they sound really, really good. And uh, a little bit earlier, they had a demo, and uh, I heard them, and they really sound amazing. And they have uh, two woofers, and the the mids and the tweeters are in the center, which is uh, level to your ear. But you need to find a big enough house to uh, fit these guys. Suntech is from Australia and I really like this brand. Since I was uh, young I had this Suntech uh, speakers. Uh, this is a Burmaster from Germany. I don't know, have you heard of this brand before? Uh, you guys get the Mercedes in the North America and you have to pay for the optional hi-fi stereo system and this is the original home system. And these are really high-end systems. And check out these uh, little speakers. They look like floor speakers, but they have a massive woofer on the side. And uh, yeah, look at that amplifier, it's really nice. And if you wanna spend a lot of money here, uh, this is the place to go. And this is the Burmaster booth here. And uh, they have other brands of uh, speakers. Something I, this is the audio visual hi-fi uh, show. I really al always wanted to come here. I'm here uh, walking this uh, AV show, but I think there's two floors. The second floor is all private rooms, so they can hear the really uh, expensive speakers. And uh, some of these speakers go up to a million dollars, which is crazy. Yeah, so I, I probably won't be listening to it. I'll, I'll just vlog over here. So anyways, uh, thank you very much for watching my video. Give me a like, subscribe to my channel. And uh, again, thank you for my patrons always supporting me. You guys are awesome. And uh, yeah, give a like and uh, I'll see you guys around. Bye.